Let me tell you about a time that my client refused to pay me while I curl my hair. I first want to say there's no hate to this client, honestly, over it, use it as a learning experience, so I don't want you guys saying anything mean about her, okay? But anyways, okay, so I did this girl's hair and we did a full highlight appointment and then nine days later she texted me and said, hey, um, could I come in and have you re-root smudge and retone my hair? Which then I responded, of course, and I sent her a picture of my cancellation policy. I'll put it right here. Okay, you can pause to read it, but it pretty much just says if you don't contact me within three days, you're responsible for the charge. And to that, she replied, okay, sounds good. And then we scheduled an appointment and she came in and I toned it and it was much. The day she came in, it was super busy. I had my assistant there helping me. And so when we finished her, I just told her, okay, I'll just text you and let you know the price and you can Venmo me. And I have done that with her before. So I thought it was no big deal. So then later that night, I texted her and I let her know the price of the appointment. And she replied and said that she was unaware that there would be a charge and she thought that the cancellation policy was going to be for next time. And to that I replied, okay, if you didn't think that you should have asked, it's fine. But so then I said, okay, and I lowered the amount and I just said for the confusion, you can just send me this much money. And she didn't reply and so I sent her a Venmo, re Venmo request, which she denied and later told me that she would just not be paying me at all. And we did go back and forth for a while, just telling both of our sides of the story. And long story short, I just told her, I can't force you to pay me, but I think you need to find a new hairstylist. So I want to know what you guys would do in this situation. For me, I just kind of left it and used it as a learning experience, but I do still kind of feel like I was cheated. But let me know in the comments from like a stylist and a client point of view what you would do in this situation.